What's up, guys? Welcome uh -huh. to Wet Paint yeah. on the yeah. Couch. Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. Where's uh -huh. the breakdown? Looking for yeah. the breakdown. Uh -huh. yeah. Where's the breakdown? All right. Back with the brand new season, season two. Uh, I was in a little bit of a hiatus. You know, had to get myself right, had to get my mental right. Alrighty, so, um, yep, I was, uh, I had to get off this for a little bit. Uh, and so I decided to take a little break, have a little season end. Now it's a season begin, season two. Um, gonna try to start cranking these out a little bit more because this is a couch. This is your therapy. This is my therapy. We go like this. This is what we do. I was dealing with some isms. Uh, you know that IZM. I uh, had I had to deal with it. I had to cope with it. I pushed a lot of people away, uh, especially my wife. Uh, you know, but. That's what makes us stronger. That's uh, when you can get through stuff like that. Mental health is real, dude. You got to uh, you gotta really pay attention to that. You got to take care of yourself. Don't stress out. Life's too short. Got this new cat. Every time the cat poops, it smells like death. Let's see what's been happening with me. Getting the yard right. Uh, about to build a deck. About to install sliding glass doors. All that jazz. Do some construction. Change my life. Build my life up. Things are going good. Thinking positive. I don't know, man. Not a lot's been happening. Not a lot's been happening that I can talk up here about. You know, and, and I, I'd like to vent now and again, but y'all don't need to know everything. Uh, other than your boy's doing good. I just seen them. They, they passed a few laws over here. Uh, well, not in my county. They uh they put this uh they they they're really uh cracking down on pipes these kids with pipes and stuff. See, I'm down for that. A lot of people out here aren't, and I and I get it. You know what I'm saying? This is the country. This is USA. This is America. And you know they you you think that you own your property. You should make your property. If you want to paint your house blue. And they would let you do that. If you wanted to do it stripes and polka dots, you have all right to do that. If you want to put polka dots and stuff on your car, you have all rights to do that. I guess the inspection company or the, the shops that are doing the inspections are sp supposed to be failing these cars that have these pipes on them, modified pipes. But yeah, they, they're supposed to be failing these uh, these cars, these vehicles, these trucks, these Jeeps, whatever. Uh, they have these modified pipes on them because it's 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 illegal. It's like having too much too dark of tint. So they're cracking down on those shops if they if they get pulled over or something and they see that you have a recent inspection or whatever. You know they're gonna know that that this these inspection shops aren't following the law. Um, I'm all for it. Fucking crack down on these guys, man. There is nothing like. Absolutely nothing like sitting at home with all your windows open. You're watching a movie. You're feeling the breeze. You're watching TV with your family. You're cuddling on the couch. You just got off work. And all of a sudden, you hear... <laughs> Sounds a little different than that, but... You know, just loud as fuck for no reason. Why do you have to draw so much attention to yourself, dude? And why do you? Why does it seem like you only fucking rev it up when you go buy a house? We live out in the county. There's like three, four houses every mile, or a house every mile. Yeah, I man, that shit's ridiculous. I'm all for it. Some people were talking about some. Well, we need to take that focus, and the police need to take that focus and put towards the the city and 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 making the crime rate go down and and attacking the drugs and. And all that shit, man. Dude, listen. That stuff's never going away. You will always have drugs. You will always have crime. Wherever there's money, there's corruption. I don't know anything about the city council. I don't know anything about the police out here. I don't get involved with that. Okay? I'm not political. I don't give a shit. Um, 
You know, I'm the type of person that's like, hey, look, a dictator's coming to do all this shit. Man, we've been dealing with dictators forever. We just change them out every four fucking years. What else is new? I'm just down for whatever. Listen, if I, as long as I'm alive or my rights, fuck it, dude. What? What? Yeah, if they start controlling YouTube and shit, guess what? I just won't fucking do it. It's not that big of a deal. I forgot what I was fucking saying. I am sure that somewhere down the line, the drugs that are coming into this city are going back to the police. They're using that to sell this and sell that and control this and control that. Dude, it, happen- it's ha- it happens in our government. Why wouldn't you think it's happening in your small town? Um, The city is profiting off this shit. Drug dealing is just a way to put more money back into the economy out here. It's like buying a Snickers. You walk up to a strange guy on the street, man. You're like, hey, dude. I heard you got that good Snickers, man. I know. I heard you got that one with extra nuts. I need it. I need those nuts, man. I need the nuts. Don't hit me with the paydays. Keep your Reese's and your Rolos. But yeah, I'm all down. I'm down for the, the pipes being cracked down on. Not a fan of the pipes. Yeah, a lot of people are pissed off about that. But um, another thing is, too, that I just found out that they had passed or whatever. They passed some more bills in the damn <laughs> stripper, man. My sister's a stripper. Um, not anymore. She changed her life. You know what I'm saying? They passed a bill to... So you don't have to have a a, a permit, a, a gun permit, to own a gun or to buy a gun or own a gun. Again, I don't own a gun. I own a shotgun. I went to, I bought a shotgun. You're allowed to do that. And I just found out that now you can do the same thing with sh- with handguns. Correct me if I'm wrong, because God forbid if I'm wrong, I don't want somebody fuck, uh, sitting there saying that. Then I'm stupid. I think that's okay. But for the for people to pass that, you know, and it's all about, you know, the Second Amendment, uh, you know, your right to bear arms, all that stuff. I'm sitting there saying I'm not political, but yet I'm talking about fucking laws and shit and, like, gun control. Um, do I think guns are bad? No. Prisons aren't safe, and there's no guns in there. Uh, you get fucking shanked. People are always going to find a way to hurt people. Shit, we have well, people are getting hurt by words right now. Goddamn, you don't even need a magazine. You just need to say something in a magazine. Read something in a magazine. Not the magazine. You know what I'm saying? The blick, blick, blick. It's cool because, like... You know, you, you still, if you're a felon, you know, or a fel- you have any felonies or anything, your background check comes out bad, you can't get a gun. I get that, but you also can't vote. That's dumb. You're, like, not a member of society if you're a felon. I don't like to be too opinionated on situations like that. I I got a few friends that are, like, really left-wing and then friends are super right side or whatever the fuck. Democrats, Republicans, liberals, pes- Um I just, you know, I, I'm i just a kid at the cafeteria in school. Hang out with the black kids. Hang out with the smart kids. Hang out with the Asian kids. Hang out with the gothic kids. Hang out with the skaters. Hang out with the fucking everything. Uh, white, uh, black, Mexican, Chinese, chicken, uh, anybody. Your boy's down for him. Because it's like, dude, I don't even... I don't see it. I don't judge people off their color. I don't... I mean, everybody is what they are. Every, you know, you... You get some people that fit the stereotypes perfectly. Then you get people that don't. So 
So I'm starting up, uh, getting off that crazy shit. I'm starting up 59 Co. again. <laughs> Link is going to be in the description below. Doing real big stuff with the design, man. You know, I I go into these phases where, uh, like, I'll want to screen print real bad or do, like, like make the shirts. Heat transfer, vinyl, um, you know, everything that's cool that I think. Then I'll be like, man, I really, that's just so stressful. I really don't want to do it. Then I'll, I'll go and uh, be like, man, I really wanted to design the logos. I'm the designer. Then it's, a, um, then it's like, okay, I'll design it, but then I'll just go, I'll put it on a website for someone else to make and buy it and do all that shit. It's just, I know that I'm not consistent. I know that I change every three months because like dude my life is so lopsided like i i look at people you know and it's like people that make podcasts youtubers it's like they're super good actors because i honestly couldn't see me having to do this and fit in uh or be trendy Cause it's like, or it's like when people, like peep, other people seem to have their shit together. They, uh, you know, it's just like they, people, I feel like other people in the world wake up and they're like, this is what I want to do. And then they're on that the whole time. Like so much drive and ambition and goals and shit just to be this one thing. And then they might end up doing it or they might end up not, but it's either that or bust. You know, and I'm like juggling all this shit. Like, uh, you want to be a rapper? You want to be a graphic designer? You want to make fucking posters? You want to design shit? Uh, I think I said design twice. Uh, you want to learn the English language? A grammar, punctuation. <laughs> um, and dude, on top of that, I think it's it's. I got to be a good dad and a good husband. Uh, and shit, a fucking good person. It's like, and a good a good boss. I got to be a good em- employee. I got to be a hard worker. And it's like, fuck, man. I can't just, I'm, I'm 30 years old. I can't just quit my job and start doing shirts. It's just not realistic. Unless this blows up and like people really start fucking with me and I get paid from YouTube. Like, I will always work where I work, and I will always come home and be a dad and husband, which I'd be that anyways, but (sighs) I feel like people with dreams, man, and then those people that make it, they're either really lucky or they're just like, that's the only thing they can think of all the time, and my brain is so ADD'd out. I got like fucking 18 D's in my ADDs. If I ate alphabet soup, the only letters in there would be ADD. And then after I get sick of those, I go buy the next brand, which is ADHD. And then I'll stop off and buy me a 12 pack of depression. (laughs) Just kidding. (laughs) And some of the shit, like, it's crazy because. I wrote a script. I watch this one guy that uh, I normally watch his YouTubes all the time, Danny Gonzalez, and I was seeing how he like does his his stuff, like his setup and everything like that. And I was like, dude, this guy. I was watching him before I even watched this video, and or watched this video I'm talking about. And this dude has a script. He has. Uh, you know, he does, like, it's fucking nuts, and he, he edits everything by himself, it'd be cool if I could take all this, and send it to somebody, and have him do it, and edit it, and have it all nice and pretty, and, and, and shit like that, but I can't, but yeah, dude, he's got a script, and I said, I was like, maybe that's what I'm missing, 
So I sit down there and I make a script and stuff for th- this one because I was like, season two is going to be so different. Season two is going to be I'm gonna have we got the new intro maybe. So if this is the same intro as the last videos, that means that I couldn't get it what I want to work. And if you even made it this far, I mean, some of you guys only like I think the longest watch time for the videos for season one was like. 20 minutes that was like the average and like i think all five episodes are like an hour i'm also going to do shorter videos man because i don't think i can fit a lot of content in these videos like like the intro of this is real sloppy so if you've gotten this far congratulations i just want to get up here and and just talk i don't want to have a script i tried writing a script it was shit you know, pinpoints are great, but it's like, what do I need to like, I think, you know, I have an idea. I think we're going to change some stuff up. Maybe we won't be on couch anymore. i just kidding. I've just put these here today because my dogs lay on this shit and they get all hairy. Uh, more videos to come. We're going to, we're all going to grow together. We're going to grow together, die together. Like and subscribe. Show some love. Notification. Send me some money. Cash apps. 5880 customs. And that's it, dude. I'm sure I was rambling on about something that I didn't even finish talking about. But that's what you have to look forward to. All right? You have a good one. Bye. Bye.